they dilated my eyes. Oh, Finally, see again. <laughs> Yay! So after after my eyes were dilated, it was so difficult for me to see things or to focus on the things close to me. Like for example, reading text like this, like this close. I have to put my phone way away from me. Para maklaro na ako. So weird. So yes. So the reason why, I think one of the reasons why they dilated my eyes is to check the back of my eyes if they're still healthy. And the doctor said, no, Kira, they're still healthy. They're hanging in there. And yeah, it took a couple of months, uh, months. It took a couple of hours before that solution drop wear off. That looks at whole and it actually would take another hour, I guess. But I'm uh, and now that my eyes are in good condition, fully functioning the good, I'm going to run to the nearest supermarket here. Actually, it's the newest as well. Nearest and newest supermarket. I'm going to pick up some stuff for my husband, get some water. We're running low of water and milk and some vegetables. So I'm trying to really limit myself going out. Pero kinahanan jud siya. Kinahanan gid ka nga makikipag sa palaran sa mga tao. Makikipag sa palaran. I really needed to. So I really need to. So what my plan is is to take some videos inside and I'll show you what the newest supermarket in town looks like and tell me what you think about it. I'll talk to you later. So that's the newest supermarket here in town. The name is Food City. I should have parked closer and facing there though. Actually, mas hayag pantag niya karon kung dili pa dagong dagom and it's already 8:17 p.m. That's the reason why I really like summer here, kay longer longer days. So even until 8:45 almost nine high gap and shot and if you go further north must high Patricia and yeah I can't wait to show you guys the inside of it so it looked be Ice, ng 
So I'm heading now. Oh, by the way, so I figured it will be a long night for me. So it doesn't hurt to get an iced coffee for tonight. And I'm so sorry I wasn't able to take any video clips there. I got busy. He was busy. So I think it was a perfect not the perfect timing so my take for today before I close this vlog is that we want our physical eyes our vision to be 2020 clear and we should also do that with our figurative eyes let's not let all these negative things around us cloud our figurative eyes we should focus on the very beautiful future that was set or that is set for us and the Bible tells us a very very positive very beautiful future that is a, that is waiting for all of us so let's focus on that not focus on these horrible things that's been happening and that's it that's a wrap have a good day or night or afternoon and i'll see you next time bye